Stickers, stickers are cool. Stickers because they stick. They stick and you yeah. can put them everywhere in the city. You put a sticker somewhere and then somebody else puts a sticker over there and you're like, ah, oh, you crossed me, you put another sticker over there. Sort of craze or passion to just be known everywhere. It's like this idea behind hip hop that you just make the world yours by putting your name everywhere. It sounds like we are really, <laughs> it sounds like we're capitalist colonizers. Yeah, yeah, yeah but no, it's not really the opposite time, actually. We became a band in Berlin, you know, like a lot of people when they move to Berlin, they, they, they discover their creative streak. That's also <laughs> happened to us, you know. Before he was really happy in the Maastricht party scene, like, ooh, it's small town. And then he moved to Berlin and he was really uh, disappointed that there were only like techno parties. And then he was like, we should do something about that. And then we, our first song we wrote about minimal is whack, about the whackness of minimal techno music. Wir sind wie die Sinnflut und wir spülen dich weg. Boom! It's a spectacular, unique place. It used to be an airfield and now it's uh, just a park and a place of unique opportunities, I would say, because it's just such a massive open thing. I always feel a bit like at the beach here and it's like super relaxing to come here. Nine years ago, there was a Volksentscheid, so a people's vote, the first one that was actually successful. So Laura was very active in the campaign itself of collecting all those votes. <laughs> because they wanted to build apartments and uh, offices and yeah, all the malls, all the shit they like to build in all the places. When I moved to Berlin, this was still an airfield and there were airplanes arriving. And now we're sitting in a community garden. Fits also our ideas of the band and what we're trying to achieve perfectly. Yeah, I think it's important to, to, to mention that we are also politically active next to uh, our, what we do musically. So as part of our jobs, you know, all of us have NGO jobs. It can also be a frustrating world, but of course we already picked those jobs because we want to make a change, you know, for the better. But I could actually see how my activism was, was influenced by um, the music we were making and also the music is, is influenced by the politics next to the music. So it, it really actually grew more and more and more together over time. Zuzis, yeah, it's a kind of a play of words. In German, you have the word zugezogen. That means somebody moving from outside of the city. Friends that are really from Berlin, they would sometimes say, ah, you're going to that pub, it's a Zuzi pub, or that's a Zuzi cafe. And then we kind of took this bad word, Zuzi, or a bit pejorative, and we just writ it differently, and then we turn it around, we claimed it. Total sell out, alle raus am Hermann Place. Solidarity und es gibt Knüppel in your face. So. Oh. Dankeschön! Protest, it's our favorite way of gig, because there's, it's during the day, it's good weather, you're on a moving state, like a, usually it's on the back of a truck or something. The people, they are really happy that somebody is entertaining them because they are usually just walking for 10 kilometers to Berlin and have to chant the whole time, ah, anti, anti capitalist, and if they don't chant that nothing's going on. And then we come and there's just these crazy people on a truck and they're just singing about something then even ideally that's a bit fitting even to the topic of the protest. It's motivating, it's great, and we get a lot of out of that. And we like to, it's definitely the best way to be part of a protest for us to play there. Yeah. It's nice to be a pawn, but it's more important to be nice. Eat the rich. Okay. Michael recycled, Zora, you know, wow, I made a new beat, check this out. And, doo -doo 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 -doo. and then we just think of, okay, what, what topics are good for hate attainment? Because that's kind of what inspires us most, things we really don't like, we feel frustrated about, you know, things that piss us off. So we kind of channel that energy back into creative fuck you energy. Cops, they are kind of parts of, you know, like 
the politics of fear, right? That they actually try to induce fear in the communities, but they're also like, oh, you have to be very, uh, you know, you have to be very afraid of all those, you know, migrants and like, I don't know, like these strange people. <laughs> The whole song Hot and Salty, it's about kind of eating soup at a protest, so it's about the nourishing thing that you need. And then uh, the whole joke was that in the end, cops get transformed into vegetables, and then somebody comes in and just makes a soup out of those ex cops, now vegetables, and eats it. Typically we take this topic that we want to hate on, but then all of us have a very different approach on how to interpret it and the song in the end becomes often quite abstract. <laughs> We would have a demo version we would uh, present live and then we start really taking ownership of the song which we need to make actually a good recording and a good track that we can release then for the market. The underground market. Yeah, the underground, yeah. <laughs> The big commercial success has been denied until now, but because we're hell so happy in the too, underground. Yeah, because we're, we're just too crazy. Yeah. Too <laughs> krass. Too krass. So one of our first press releases wrote world domination and of course we have this long arching uh, goal to change the world and conquer it. It doesn't mean only world domination, it means actually to replace the status quo. We're all really politically minded people or like active people in our ways, but this band, what we're doing, the music we're making is an outlet where we don't have to write a position paper and don't have to be super politically correct about it or don't have to be nuanced in all the arguments. We can be creative, we can be loud, we can yell, we can just vent. Sonne steckt am Horizont fest, Europa bedeckt die Vergangenheit mit Bomben und lässt die Gegenwart zuvor schon verkommen. Abolish police! Abolish crime! 